Um, I think what I said to the team, the, the feeling that I had after Sunday's game compared to Friday's game um, up at American was that we had asked for changes. We're, we're definitely make, making small steps. I would certainly like these steps to be a little quicker um, so we can make some adjustments and, and, and I think more so break down our mistakes. Um, you know, yes, we're playing high quality teams here who have had uh, some big wins early in the season, but I, I feel like we're giving away too many chances, um, you know, finishing off some opportunities we had in, in cage, but also, you know, not giving away corners that we don't need to, which, you know, have led to several goals against us. Well, the, the joys of going to Georgetown, where we're obviously playing on their field turf, on their football field. So, you know, when I was preparing for this, we always have to play Towson on their football field. So I thought if we at least play one game like this a season, it will always just feel like, OK, here we go again, instead of, you know, the little freak out that we normally do before we play Towson on their football field. You know, Georgetown with uh, Shannon Carl, who graduated from William and Mary, you know, we're going to expect, they're going to be technically strong on their own field, but I think if we, you know, we don't overthink it, we just go out and play good hockey, I'm hoping that, you know, we walk away with a strong win. And then to flip around and prepare for ODU, it's always a tough game between the two schools and you know a game that we certainly look forward to each year so you know ODU um, a couple of girls you know I've, I've coached through the high performance program throughout the summer so you know it, it's always going to be a fast hard fought game and I think you know this year it'll come down to a one goal game and I hope that you know that advantage is to us.